Just an itty bitty bitty bought a couple on the road. Driving it hard, he pulling a toad. No place special to roam. Not looking for a home. Won't you come along with us? We are our place travels. We're on our way to Catherine's Landing, which is part of the Lake Mead National Recreational Area but it's the furthest campsite south. Which is as far down south as you can go in Nevada and then hitting the beginning of, of uh, Arizona. It's actually right in Bullhead City, Arizona. So Bullhead City is a little city that we actually visited a few years ago because we were interested in it. Didn't we heard a lot about um, a good place to retire. So we kind of checked it out the last time we went to uh, Las Vegas. Which was several years ago. And we didn't care for it back then. But now we spent a week there, and it started growing on us as a town. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, Loser's Lounge. <laughs> it's open Thursday through Sunday. That's us. <laughs> That's where all the nickel slots are? I don't know. <laughs> we were here before, you know. We were. I know. Um, welcome to Bullhead City, Arizona. Los Mad... Doros. Doros. We went to Lachlan, Nevada, which is right across the river. The Colorado River, yeah. yeah. Bullhead City's on one side and Laughlin's on the other side. We went there uh, for an evening. We had fun. We actually went over there the day before. Uh, we were going to spend the day there to get tickets. The only thing available was a Christmas special with uh, Peter, Paul, and Mary's tribute band. We had to wait an hour for the ticket. The ticket. Window to open. And um, their copy machine to make the tickets wasn't working. So we had to wait a little bit. I think the lady felt sorry for us for waiting so long. So she, she actually gave us free tickets to the show, which is great. And it was really close to Christmas. We were kind of looking forward to getting into the spirit of Christmas. That was Saturday to get the tickets. Sunday was the day that we spent the day at uh, the hotel. So we spent the day at the Riverside Casino gambling on our slot machine because that's all we do in a casino. Yeah, it was penny slot machine Penny too. slots <laughs> and we spent most of the day on the slot machine and we each lost five dollars. Not bad for a day's entertainment. But there were other things to do there while we were there. On the third floor they have a um, car museum huge car museum and it was wonderful they had some really nice cars there we had dinner yeah after we played the slots right before the show we went out to a uh, mexican restaurant there on the second floor and then we went to the show we thought it was going to be more christmasy because mm -hmm. it's christmas time and the point of it was to get into the christmas spirit they did not just christmas but peter paul and mary songs mm -hmm. all their big hits was when i was a kid and I remember bopping around singing them. It just kind of brought back some cute memories when I was a kid. We took a day and we went to the town of Kingman. We went to the powerhouse station and museums. Um, it is the Welcome Center that's there. You have to get tickets to go through it. You buy one ticket and you can go to three different museums. But we only could go through one because the rest of them were closed for Monday. A lot of museums are closed on Monday. I don't know why, but they are closed on Monday. I was kind of looking forward to a bunch of houses that we could go through, museum houses. So we were a little sad about that. But um, the upstairs is about the history of Kingman. And they had a little movie theater that uh, talked about um, Route 66 going through Kingman. In the basement, they had an electric vehicle museum, the history of electric cars, because it's a power station. And it was so funny because they all look like little golf carts yeah. in the beginning. So it's, it's just funny looking. So there, there was a lot there to see. We went around through Kingman. Um, just seemed like a normal town. Yeah, so that's pretty much what we did in Kingman. We didn't spend a lot of time there. Campsite, we stayed uh, Catherine's Landing. It was out of season for them, too. Yeah. So there weren't a lot of people there, either. It looked like they had a really nice restaurant and store there, but they were closed. The water was high. It wasn't like Lake Mead on the other side of it. This is called Lake Mojave on the side that we were on. I thought it was a great little place that we kind of... It stuck. served its purpose. Yeah, for a few days just to go check some stuff out. Okay, so that, that was pretty much our stay there. 
mm-hmm. Catherine's Landing. From here, we're moving on down to Quartzsite. I'm excited. Going to Quartzsite. So we'll see you down there. Bye. Bye.